such a freak for Apple and I'm so surprised I haven't made a video on my Apple Watch because I use this bad boy every single freaking day. Like I haven't left the house without her since I got her. Okay, so you guys know how much I love Apple. I would give everything to Apple. I would give them my whole purse, my whole life savings, which isn't a lot, but you know what I mean? It's the thought that counts. So anyways, hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Haley, and today we're gonna dive deep into my Apple Watch. I'm gonna show you the nitty gritty of my Apple Watch. I'm gonna show you that I never match my Apple Watch bands to my outfit, and that is why I always look a mess. Like, come on. Let's just jump into this video because I have a lot to talk about because I talk a lot. So I love, I love, with a capital L and a capital E, I love my Apple Watch. <laughs> I should be the spokesperson for Apple, like please, Apple, I know you're not watching this, but contact your girl. Okay, so I'm big on my Apple Watch, as you can clearly tell. I am literally lost without it when I don't wear it, okay? And that is a problem. I am so dependent on, you know, technologies. Okay, so let me tell you my favorite watch faces because I have a couple. So my all-time favorite watch face is California. I don't know what it is, but I just feel like it looks so... Okay. Let me tell you, I change the color of this watch face every single day because I am so indecisive and I can't keep one color, okay? I love choices. <laughs> the next one is a modular. Is that how you say it? I sound stupid. Anyways, this one was my all-time favorite when I first got my Apple Watch. I just love how big the time is and I love how big the date is. It's I don't know. I just like that one, okay? I have recently discovered that I love this watch face. I have it on right now because I can't take it off. I really like it, actually. I think it makes it look super sleek and super pretty and super simple. And it's literally called Simple. It's this one right here. And I just, I really like it. I don't know what it is. It just looks so clean. So those are my top three favorite watch faces. I know that they're super simple. Okay, so jumping right into what is actually on my Apple Watch, I feel like this is gonna be a little bit boring, but let's get into this. So starting off with the layout of my apps, I made it into a heart, because why not? If I have the chance to make my apps look cute, I'm going to take it. So the first app is Allstate. Um, I don't know how to explain that one. I'm just in good hands, so. Next, I have photos, I have weather, which is pretty self-explanatory. So the next app is Walkie Talkie, which um, I freaking love that app. I find it so much fun, especially when I'm like, you know, bothering people all the time. Then I have the app that measures your heartbeat. I have the maps, which, oh my God, this is a lifesaver. I don't know if you know this about me, which you probably don't. I am the worst at direction. I literally get lost going home. So I always use Siri, even though like sometimes she takes me to the wrong place, but it's whatever. But not having to look at my phone and having to only look at my Apple Watch for when, you know, I'm driving some Somewhere and my GPS is telling me where to go has been a game changer. Then I have the App Store, which I barely go on. I feel like I should skip past a lot of these. I don't know. Okay, so then I have the Alarm app on my Apple Watch, and I also have the World Clock, and also just the regular clock that just takes you back to your watch face. Okay, so I don't know what this ear thing is at the top. 12 seconds later. Oh, that's so cool. It turns out the Noise app is actually an app that tells you when a nearby sound is actually gonna hurt your ears which is incredible that technology is able to do that like come on then I have the clue app which is my period tracking app <laughs> bit of a TMI but here we are so then we have the discover app which is my credit card app I don't know why it's on my Apple watch then I have the messages app which oh my god I love getting my messages on my Apple watch I find it so satisfying to get that little I don't know the vibrations on an Apple watch feels so cute next I have the timer app and LA Fitness which I no longer go to that gym so I should really delete that app but it's gonna really mess up my heart so I'm not going to but eventually I hope to delete that app. Then I have Uber which fun fact I've only been in an Uber once. 
Why did I say that? I have no idea. Calculator app, which I never use. Okay, and then we have the fitness app, which I try to use every day, but at the same time, why am I playing myself? I don't use it every day. And next up is the app that makes me feel bad every single day, okay? The activity app. I try to close those rings every single day, but it gets past me sometimes, okay? I sometimes don't close my rings and it makes me feel bad the next day. It's like, oh, you were doing so good, Haley. Like, why didn't you close all your rings? How about today you try to close more than one ring? And then I'm just like, mind your business, Apple Watch. Mind your business. But at the same time, thank you for making me feel bad. Because maybe I'll work out today. Just maybe though. I know that we have made it this far into the video, but I feel like I need to change my Apple Watch band because it's kind of making me upset that it doesn't really match the vibe in this room. So since we're kinda on the topic of bands, I might as well show you guys the other bands that I have. So I don't have that many considering that I have so many cases. I don't have a lot of watch bands. So I'm failing somewhere. Anyways, I got this one off of Amazon and it's supposed to be like the pink sand version. I really like it. I think it's really pretty, but it got dirty so fast, so I rarely ever use it. So my favorite place to get Apple Watch bands, though, is from Target, because Heyday has them for $10, and they look so good. So I got the pink version and the light blue version of the Apple Watch bands from Target. I recommend these 100%. They're so freaking good, and they're only $10. $10. <laughs> And then I got the Apple Watch bands that I got when I got my watch. And I love the black on black. I think it looks so sleek. It looks so simple. So back into our apps. So next up we have iTunes. We have this play button, which I have never seen. So I have to go double check that and see what that is. Remote, it's remote which I am confused. I don't have a TV in my room, if you are curious. I don't really watch TV, so I will never use this app. Maybe one day, but not today. Then I have Find My Apple Watch or Find My iPhone, whatever it is, podcast. Then we have My Fitness Pal because sometimes, just sometimes, I like to track my calories, but it's so rare. It's like once in a blue moon because I really could care less how much I'm eating. <laughs> Then we have the most annoying app out here, and it's the Breathe app. Listen, why are you telling me to breathe every six minutes? Am I that stressed out? Yes, but I'm not gonna breathe for a minute because I don't have time. I Every single time that notification comes up, I never have time to breathe, and I'm just like, listen, I'm at work. I'm talking to a customer. Then we have settings. Then we have wallet, which I love Apple Pay. I just recently discovered it cherry on top so good Etsy which I don't know why I have it on my Apple watch but here it is <laughs> we have the phone we have cycle reminders which I am so confused on how to make a reminder so don't get me started on that I have messenger which I never go on Facebook so I have no idea why it's there then we have um, what is this <laughs> y'all can you tell that I never go on my Apple watch clearly E C G. Okay. Yeah. Something with your heart. Okay. So that one is music. Then this is the app that I recently discovered that I really freaking love. It's I am. <laughs> now y'all know me as the negative person out here. I always tell you that somebody called me negative and ever since then it's resonated with me. So I am trying not to be as negative because honestly at the time I was really negative, but now look at me prospering. <laughs> So this app gives you notifications throughout your day that tell you little sentences that when you read it in your head, like you feel like you're saying it yourself. I don't know how to explain it, but it says like, I am beautiful. And you're like, oh, that's so sweet. Why did I, I am beautiful. <laughs> Something like that, okay? Usually they're really deep. Like this one, it says, I am happy to be who I am, where I am, and when I am. Like. That's just a random notification throughout your day and it just comes to your phone and it, 
I don't know, saying it in your mind kind of brings it out and like into the world and it kind of makes me feel a little bit better so let's just ignore the fact that I'm weird and I am just listening to my phone talk to me so there's that <laughs> I definitely recommend it if you are trying to get more positive affirmations in your life so there's that I am is a really good app then we have the camera button which I take a lot of my Instagrams with this Apple watch because like I take a lot of my pictures myself we have voice memos radio and then we have minimalist minimalist list list so it's just like random, like if you need a to-do list, that's where you would write it and it would like show up on your watch and you just check them off. That is a good app as well. Then we have Smart Gym, which I don't know what that is and I feel like I'm gonna have to figure that out soon. Calendar is all the way at the bottom and I don't know why it moved all the way down there. I feel like I had to rearrange all these apps because um, my heart messed something up. It messed something up around here. <laughs> then we have LiveSum, which I have never used. I think I downloaded it and forgot about it. And that is why I never download apps. <laughs> okay, so the next app is Stanland. Yeah, Stanland, which is this weird little guy in the corner. Um, supposedly, it like tracks how much times you stand throughout your day and like if you like stand a lot. It's just a happy little animal. I will like insert a little clip of it. I don't know why I downloaded this app, but here I am downloading the weird stuff for you guys. <laughs> and then last but not least, I have email, mail, mail, whatever you want to call it. That one right there. And that is what is on my Apple Watch. I feel like this was the most boring video ever. I don't know. Was it boring? Did you guys enjoy it? I don't know. I don't even know. I feel like there's not that much left to say about my Apple Watch, so I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, the button's down below. And if you guys wanna see me on any other social medias, I'll have them right here for you. And I will see you guys for the next video. Bye!